بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على سيدنا محمد استكمالا للدرس السابق حيث شرحنا بشكل نظري كيفية تقسيم المعطيات إلى معطيات خاصة بتدريب الآلة ثم معطيات خاصة بالتجريب أو التست الآن سننتقل إلى إلى التطبيق تخيل دائما مثال مثال ثمن السيارات المستعملة انطلاقا من سنوات الأقدمية ثم عدد الكيلومترات المقطوعة إذن عندنا ملف إذن سنقوم بتقسيم المعطيات إلى جزئين الجزء الأول خاص بالتدريب النموذج ثم الجزء الثاني خاص ب التجريب. Uh, our purpose in this video is to switch to the practice and learn how to split يعني تقسيم how to split uh, our data sets into two parts one for training and the second for tests with a specific class in scikit-learn so go to the practice we have a uh, we prepared the csv file csv file cell price upon uh, milliage and uh, age so we uh, go to a python file to write a program to split this data frame into two parts so go to do, go to test split training test the first step is import pandas library so first step uh, import pandas library pandas library Voilà. With Pandas, you can uh, affect, you can affect uh, data analysis and and work with uh, data sets and uh, transform the features and targets to uh, uh, matrix aspects. Uh, you can write import, so import Pandas as pandas and now the second shape upload upload the file upload the data frame into uh, into file so from file so the second step load data set from from CSV file, we can we can apply the read CSV to upload our data set. So our data frame equal data frame equal pandas dot read pandas dot read CSV and we give the name of the the csv file the name is price car so price car dot csv we can print the data frame to check the result so we can write print data frame uh, bismillah check our code uh, very good we have a data set with columns and rows so uh, it's perfect now we uh, extract we uh, plot a curve to present cell car upon uh, vs or age or millage so we can we can uh, plot so the curve step try to plot the curve uh, which presents the sale price this this age for example so we can import so in Bot matplotlib mat plotlib dot by plot as plt 
matplotlib import Sorry, uh, matplotlib. So, matplotlib dot ml. Now we can trace or draw the curve. So we can use alt dot scatter. Two brackets. Data frame. So we data frame can use price size so price uh, in axis X and Y. Okay. Age, for example, to show the uh, linear or relationship between two uh, axes. So we can plot both show. Now we try to, to check the results. Before that, check the name of the color is correct. Go to uh, price car, sell price and age. Very good. Sell price and so execute our program. Now we can uh, verify and check that there is a linear relationship between uh, sale price and age of car very good we can now use the uh, uh, linear linear regression the fold so we can drop two lines and the first shape extract first shape is to uh, extract uh, x features and target variable so we can do this with, uh, with our data frame so x equal uh, data frame Uh, go to uh, CSV file. Uh, we have features millage and other features is age and uh, the target variable is sell price. And the hours in the kilometer at the millage or sin age. So the head of sell price. If we want to the number of 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 the الثمن وبالتالي X يعتبر مصفوفة من عمودين ومجموعة من الأسطر. Then go to test split or X is so DF so DF DF H or H. Age, voila, and uh, comma, age. H and H. OK. 
can print x to check the result. So so go to our file, check the result. Very good. Middle age and age. And uh, try to construct the y vector target variable f dot uh, cell price we have the x and y for our model now the main objective in this video is to extract training data sets and test data sets with scikit-learn so can give the five step uh, extract 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 training and testing data sets we can and uh, now sorry can use a specific model, scikit-learn model selection import. So we can write import scikit-learn dot model, selec model selection from, import from, sorry, from scikit-import import test, import training test, so training test splice. And there. Now we can create, create uh, uh, to 20 percent for test and 80 percent for training. So we can write x train training comma x training x Test well, Y training and uh, Y test, and we use training test split with our X and Y vector and test size test size test size equal 20 percent so we can write 0.2 now we can check the the length of x training and x and x test well we can write print print len the number of rows of x for example x training and the same we can print say can print x test to check the result x test we can write now uh, number of rows number of rows number of rows of number of rows of x training and now we can write this say now number of a number of rows of x test x test can print, for example, len of x, sorry, number of x. Now check the result. Uh, we have 10 rows, 
number of rows of extraining equal to eight and number of rows of excess equal to two. Very good. So we can now uh, create a linear regression model. So the we can bond can give a, a total of this part the sex step this step is to create a linear model linear model linear model you can write from from scikit learn dot linear model import linear model linear regression and we use the uh, constructor linear regression of the class linear regression so our model able linear regression so between now we fit fit the model training the model fit the model we can write model dot fit x so we can use x training and Y training. Now we predict, we predict X test. We predict X test. So we can uh, write uh, the print, print, can compare the test. So the test can use dot dot we can uh, um, model dot predict uh, x test x test we can write we write print uh, x test to compare x test to compare between a real value and predict value so go to run uh, so I'm Predict value do x. Predict value is so we can we can calculate the score the score to check uh, however the model is uh, correct or no. We can uh, calculate the score. So print for example uh, print and the score if we uh, like to have good uh, result we must give to the computer more training uh, data so we can score equal equal our model dot score the x training and y training can check this value the uh, value is very uh, good so alhamdulillah if we are going to be able to do the same thing with the same 
يجب أن ندخل داتا سيت تحتوي على مئات من الأرقام أو المعطيات الحقيقية ليتدرب الحاسوب جيدا إذا شكرا على انتباهكم وإلى اللقاء أحبائي الكرام